For instance, the American midsize watering hole market is still to life and not exactly on the list of endangered varieties. Toyota, the incontestable leader, has actually simply presented the following advancement of the 2025 Camry at the Los Angeles Car Program together with the Crown Cinea crossover SUV and is bearing up with the model as a unique hybrid-only choice. There are likewise prospective competitors that will certainly get to see the light of day for the 2025 MY as well, like Chevrolet's mega-affordable $25,000 Malibu or the standard Honda Accord competitor. For the 2024 model year, the last has a starting rate of nearly $28,000 and includes a 192-horsepower turbo 1.5-liter mill. Interestingly, there are even more trim variations based upon the Accord Crossbreed, which has 204 ponies and much better fuel economic climate, plus a flagship Accord Touring Crossbreed trim starting at $38,540. Yet is that adequate to fight the competition? Well, the report mill thinks that Honda requires to move fast and prepare a reasonable upgrade for the 2025 version year to stay ahead of the counter. Normally, the imaginative world of electronic automobile content designers sects that and has prepared the informal visions of exactly how the Accord crossbreed and Turing designs may appear like. On the other hand, the CGI specialist from Actual Automotive would certainly love to strike thunder and lightning at the heart of the competition by presenting an entirely upgraded Accord Turing which is probably the last point Honda would risk to do nowadays. Still, it's rather wonderful to envision that the traditional Accord would have the audacity to overhaul its appearance completely so rapidly after introducing a brand new model. So, which is your fave? By the way, as far as the powertrains are concerned, Honda requires to do something regarding the Accord Hybrid, and pretty soon. Due to the fact that 204 horsepower doesn't contrast favorably with the 2025 Camry's new scores of 225 horsepower on front-wheel drive versions and 232 horsepower for AWD variations, right?